Hi, welcome back to C++ programming tutorial. In this video, we will understand what are static members of a class. We will write a C++ program to count the number of objects created using static member. A data member prefixed with static keyword becomes the static member of a class. Irrespective of the number of objects of the class are created, there exists only one copy of the static member. A static member is shared by all the objects of the class. Now uh, we will write a C++ program to count the number of objects uh, created here. So first what we do is uh, we will include the header file that is IO stream. Next uh, we will use using keyword to include the standard namespace here. After this uh, we need to create one class uh, so that we can create a static member here. So we will say that the class is equal to counter in this case and within this particular class I will add one private member let us say that uh, static int count. So what has happened in this case is I have added a data member that is a count which is of type integer and it is a static member here because uh, of this static member whenever we create a object first time the count will be initialized to zero and uh, any time you create the new object the count will not be initialized to zero it will be uh, the new value and uh, shared by all the objects we need to initialize this particular count uh, uh, outside the class now that i will show later first we will add a uh, public section of this particular class within that i will add one uh, constructor here the uh, job of constructor is to increment the value of a count as and when a new object is created here. And uh, end of the day we will add one more member function. Let us say that uh, display. The task of display is to display the number of objects created here. Uh, I can say that uh, count uh, see out uh, the number of objects created are I will display a count here. Now uh, what has happened is uh, whenever you create an object the count will be incremented by one and uh, end of the day if you call this particular display the number of objects are displayed here. Here I will close this particular class. Now I will try to initialize the static member that is uh, count is equal to zero. But the problem here is count is a static member that is the first thing and it is a private member of this counter hence I need to use counter colon colon that is a uh, scope resolution operator I have to use here. Uh, now what I do is uh, I will add the main part of this particular program that is uh, int main and within this main I will create some series of objects. Let us say that uh, counter c1 uh, I have created the one first object so the count value will be incremented by one. Previously it was zero now it will become one. So one more time I will create an object let us say that uh, C2 now the two objects are created I will create one more object that is C3. Now you can use C1, C2, C3 or any object let us say that I will call the display function uh, with uh, third object. Whenever I create an ob uh, call this particular display function because the right now the count value is 3 the 3 will be displayed here. So the count value is shared between all these three um, uh, objects in this case. Now we will try to execute and see whether we are getting the correct output. I will try to compile and execute it. Uh, I think uh, there is a typo here. It is not count here. It should be C out because we want to display this particular message. So I will try to compile one more time. Yes, the number of objects created are 3 because we have created 3 objects, the value will be 3 in this case. It is not hard and fast to that I need to call uh, with respect to C3. I can call with respect to C2 also. I will be able to get the value as uh, uh, 3 only because that count value is shared among all these 3 objects over here. So this is how we can write a very simple uh, program to count the number of objects created using static member of a class. I hope uh, the concept is clear. You can use this particular video for your academic as well as uh, placement preparation. If you like the video, do like and share this video with all your friends. Press the subscribe button for more videos. 
press the bell icon for regular updates thank you for watching